Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So yes, it is that time again. Time to take up some champions. Uh, I'm going to take up first two rank four champions. Now, you can try to guess. One of them is a newer champion. That's your hint. The other one is a champion I got a little while ago, but I'm seeing that I need that champion a bit higher than rank three. Okay, so if you think you can guess these uh, champions, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. But we're about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. All right, so the first one is going to be White Tiger. All right, so I just recently got White Tiger, and I've seen some good things about her. Let's go ahead and uh, rank her up to four. There we go. And she seems pretty fun. All right, I played with her just a little bit. Let's see, how many of these do I have? I have 190. So let me use some of these clear. I have a lot of uh, mutant ISO, so clear that out a bit. There we go. Uh, speed this up a little bit here. Um, but one of the things that I really liked about uh, White Tiger that power steel looks crazy. And I like speed. And she looks like with that power, she can be pretty quick. I don't know how quick, but she can be pretty quick. Um, I watched uh, KT1 uh, use her, uh, what, did, what did he use her? I think in Winter of Woe. And she looked impressive. So I am taking her to rank four. I'll be using her more often in the arena now because I don't use anyone less than rank four as a six star in my normal arena grinds. Uh, where are we at? Uh, okay, yeah. Since I don't have that many... Um, mystics i didn't want to have too too many in my uh inventory so that's that's good there all right so yeah look at her and i'll be looking forward to learning more uh about her okay now the next one is one that i've had for a bit and I'll tell you a little bit more about why I'm taking this champion up. But I don't think I'm going to have to really give you guys, you know, a list. So let's go through here. And it's going to be Kate Bishop. All right. Let's take her up to rank four. There we go. Now, I do have quite a few um, uh, skill. How many do I have? Yeah, 408. So we're good on that. So Kate Bishop, when she first came out, you know, we were like, she is the um, Hawkeye that we should have gotten. All right. She is definitely a better Hawkeye. And during this last Winter of Woe, she was actually a good option for some of these fights. However, I had her at rank three and I was like, do I want to bring her in only at rank three? I don't know about that. And so I ended up not bringing her in. So now that I've taken her up to rank four, I'm going to start uh, using her more often where she can be used. 
she was also um, a good option for the Necropolis. Now, I have not finished the Necropolis 100% yet. So, who knows? Maybe I'll end up uh, taking her in there. I don't know. We shall see. Um, but definitely uh, a champion that is worthy of ranking up. Now, I also have enough Ascension Dust to ascend another uh, six star. I'm kind of holding it because what I want to do is when the Winter of Woe week five, I guess, comes, that's what I want to um, wait for because I may have a champion at rank three that is like perfect for that one. So what I'll end up doing is maybe ascending them and taking them to rank four if I have the materials. But as you can see here, I went ahead and used up um, quite a bit of materials taking up two champions to rank four. Now, the reason that I decided to take two champions to rank four, obviously um, their position to go to rank five, I'll be able to use them more in the arena. And also I looked at who I had that I could have taken to rank five currently with the resources I have. And none of them uh, I was really burning to take up to rank five, okay? So I was like, you know what? By the time I get the resources that I'm lacking, I think I will um, have the T6 uh, basic and the T3 alpha to do that. Not only that, but Kabam did something that I actually made use of um, for this. They changed, updated the uh, rank up store. Let's take a look real quick there. So in the rank up store, and you're gonna see that I did use this there. Look at the first two. I was just short of what I needed to take up two champions. I had enough for one, but I wanted to rank up two. So I said, all right, and I got four and four, and that's all I needed, okay? So I did use some units, but just to top off. So that makes a big difference. If I really want to spend units to rank up a champion, I can do that. I just need to be kind of close to what I need. So now it's the T6 uh, resources that I'm lacking, okay? Now, these others here, nah, not really. Maybe. But usually, no. There's no limit on the uh, T4 basic. Um, no limit on the T5. This tier five uh, class catalyst, seven limit, and it's not even a selector? No, thank you. The alloys, not really interested. T2 alpha, unless I'm really close and I'm short and I can't get it any other way, this is what I use this um, store for. Other than that, you know, it's there for an emergency or you just don't want to wait. Like, you know, I could have done the rank, uh, you know, white tiger rank up and then waited and then done the uh, Kate Bishop rank up. But I was like, you know what? I want to knock those out. There's a level up going on right now. Let's go ahead and do it. And I don't even know um, if I'm going to take up. I'll probably make this video um, end here. Uh, what time? Yeah. That's a that's good enough uh, of a length for a video. And then I'll make another mystery rank up video uh, for some other uh, level ups. All right. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. What do you think about my rank ups? What do you think about White Tiger? Have you used her? Any tips or tricks? Definitely leave down in the comments below because I'm going to need them. 
All right. So take care and you all have a blessed day. Thank you.